right then, tower block reviews. I'm at this estate in Shadwell. There's three of these blocks. They've got this sort of architecture. The middle one has the concierge, which is the tallest of the three of them. The other ones are just a couple of floors smaller. And these have some really nice bay lifts. It's a bit dark, so you can't see too well, sadly. But I'll show some pictures of what they look like in the daytime. But look at the architecture. I've got like brick there, and this of concrete between the floors. They're a bit different to the other towers around here. I'll show you some pictures of what I look like in the daytime. So look at these in the daytime. These blocks are slightly more narrow than other blocks and they're slightly taller, giving them that narrow but tall sort of look which I really like. They've got sort of darker bricks on the walls but they've got concrete bits for the floors giving that rather 70s look to it. And I just think they look really nice. There's also similar blocks to these in the Battersea area. So concierge tower, second tower. Got some concrete down here. And over here is the third tower. So let's go this one first. This is the smallest tower. And this one has some old Benny lifts. I hope the others have also got old Benny lifts. Open the door, tiley on the floor, which door from the 70s. That well, looks a bit like London Underground style on the central line, those sort of tiles. A row of different colours. Got a door there. And we come along to the Benny lifts, which still original. Benny indicator, that's say Benny, and button is original, which is very nice. And we've got some original glass here from the 70s. That sign's been replaced. You've got the other Benny lift here. So let's take a look around. And down there is the lower ground floor. You've got upper ground and lower ground. Again, this Benny lift. One of the buttons has been replaced with an express button, but all the other buttons are Benny buttons. I think it's hard to get hold of the Benny button, so when the button fails, they replace it with an express button. But that express button's actually from the same era as the Benny buttons. It's got quite a fast acceleration. Well, that. Weird logo instead of the Benny logo. Got Benny Metal, which you see in loads of lifts when they're modernised. But a bit that's really rare is of course the buttons, because that's the bit you don't get to see very often. This one has 16 floors, but I know the other one's got it high. Oh, DC Pulsed AC, two levelling stages. And oh, that's efficient. Nicely set up. So this architecture is similar to some of the Clapham block. We've got four flats for each floor. Unlike the Clapham ones, which have a ladder which pulls down, these ones actually have a staircase to get up to the motor room. You've got this concrete here, very nice and old, a original door, and here's the staircase. There's actually two staircases, I believe, I believe the other side has another staircase. No, the other side of this one doesn't have a staircase. It has like a little, this area here, we've also got some plants, which is a nice touch. Take a look out into Tower Hamlets. Nice indicator. If this does odd floors, that does even floors, but both lifts stop at the top floor, floor 16, which is actually the second to top floor, floor 17 to top floor. But like quite a few of these towers, the lifts do not serve the top floor. Inspection control. That's rare. Very, very rare. Nice chassis. The rarest thing is definitely that inspection control. Look at that. Look at this inspection control. Look at comb logo. Da da! No! Fuck me, man! I know, that's what I was just thinking. Of. Da. Holy fuck, this is a deep staircase. Is it no Not from here. What? Secret staircase? Fucking hell. 
so weird. Yeah, I know that someone's flat like me. <laughs> this one's got an ILE indicator. On the ground floor tower, it looks like this. Not sure what that is. Box air camera. There are two lifts. Let's take a look through here. Here's your staircase. So we're now going to try this tower. Second tower, we come in, there's a van. Concierge desk, but he's never in this tower. Concierge is in the third tower. Yeah, there's always a desk. <laughs> well, that's got the older display. The other one's got a lead display. Oh no, Leicester controls for this one. The tiling's different. I think it's 70s tiling. It looks 70s. But it's different to the tiling of the other blocks. The other one has sort of like central line style tiles. This has some more bog standard looking ones. There's your other door because there's two different doors. Here we have our Benny lift. A bit smaller this one. And this one goes tall up to 21. I wonder how other tall this one goes. Well, this is what it looks like. The building's fairly similar. Doors are different. This area is quite similar. Let's go up to floor 22. Penthouse flats. The regular floors, this are four flats like normal, but when you come to the top floor, you've got these two doors here which are locked. But it's like a corridor, which I mean, the penthouse flats are, must be tiny. These penthouses are tiny. Up a little staircase to oh, the motor room. Motor room. Oh, these look really nice. Better than I thought they would actually. A bigger than Balfron. Balfron's taller, but DC Pulse AC, but these are bigger. Oh, these are so nice. Oh, that's so nice. Cone motor installed by Benny. Thames Valley card slots and Thames Valley DC Post AC. With relays down there, AC motor regulator, DC post AC, two levelling speeds, very nice. Got a taco for your DC post AC. This is what I call a nice motor room. It's very, very nice. That is very nice. Lift motor room. Apparently on camera, we can't see it. Air conditioning room, we've got a ladder here, a ladder. There's a weird extra floor. You've got roof up there. Wow, that is a view, isn't it? The tower is taller. So this isn't the tallest tower here. During the penthouses have this corridor around. Yeah, normal flats don't. It's only the penthouse in that penthouse level has that extra corridor. Yeah. Just consider how small they are. This penthouse is a tiny. Oh, that's a shame. The tallest tower has crap lifts. Why is something smoking in the lift? And why is the tallest tower got a boring lift? The nicest one had the Benny. So disappointing. This is disappointing. This is so national, this one's lost all its 70s uh, tiles. This is the worst tower, the tallest tower. This is by far, without a doubt, the worst tower. Ground is basement, one is ground, and one in the actual ground has the fire mode, meaning one should be green, so that's against regulation. You're here for nice old glass, but this tower looks a bit run down compared to the others. There's nothing in here. It's just a, just a story. Hello. 
So we found this lift broke. So let's see if we can work out the reason why. The light's on. So obviously the engineer's in the middle of fixing this. It all looks different, it's got older tiles. Now I go into the electrical intake room. Electrical intake room, but there's nothing in here. It's just... I've got telephones. I've got those old circuit boards there. There's a lot of old stuff around this tower. But sadly, the tallest tower doesn't have any lifts. That's the only thing disappointing. Other than that, everything's been really awesome and really old in these towers. So, what's through this door? Oh, wow, look at this for a boiler. Oh, wow. It's original. No way. This is so nice. Look at that. Is that a, no, that's a generator. Yeah, it's a generator. So does that generate... Is it? That's, but look how old it is. It's, it's really old. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, look how old this is. That is so nice. Oh, look at those old lanterns. A couple of cameras down here, but not many. Bin looks so disgusting. And this is the boiler room. This is some boiler room. I know, that's what I was wondering. Oh, look at Oh, that looks nice. Look how many nice motors there are. But I think the older motors look better, as far as I'm concerned, than the newer ones. So this is the old equipment, they're getting rid of it, are they? But look, it's all open. Well, these are always about to be ripped out and replaced. I hope not, this machinery looks nice, but a new pump will be all boring. Wow, it's just... look at that. Wow. Oh, doesn't this just look so nice? All of it is off. Let's try off this staircase. Wow. You can hear equipment on the map. Yeah, it sounds like it's in here, doesn't it? This is like nothing else I've seen before. It's all original. The pipes tunnel. Oh, that tunnel looks really good, but uh, it looks really filthy as well. Oh, look at these towers. Does that just look nice? Nice 60s architecture, especially the tallest one. Well, the next time is this new build, which obviously isn't going to be anywhere as near as good. Obviously, this new build cannot beat 60s towers, but still going to have a look at it anyway. As we can see, as a new build, 60s towers are awesome. This is just a bit dull. Oh, wow, that staircase it looks like a school or something. Shit. This corridor, a bit clean. That uh, lift's not exactly that interesting. This bit here looks a bit 60s. No. But this is a sort of a, this is a 60s tower, this bit, but extension to it isn't. It's just not worth filming. Look at that, that's shit. The new build. One of those LEDs. Oh, they've got one of these weird cabinets. I call these. Fuck it. No, someone's been snorting so many illegal highs here. How many illegal highs does somebody snort in a night? Ugh. Oh.